Hey everyone, we're out here in the garage. We're starting a new building project. We've got our polyface design book because we are getting ready to build a mini brooder. We've got some meat chickens coming here in a few weeks. How many, Jackson? 150. That's right, 150 meat birds coming soon. So we've got to get a brooder built for them. So here's our polyface designs book. Got all kinds of building plans for different things. We're gonna be working on the mini brooder today. Uh, it's an eight by eight brooder that'll hold up to 250 chickens. So this book's legit, got really nice plans, uh, makes building these things real, real simple. Hi everyone! Me and Dad just got back from Lowe's where we were buying some lumber to build a chicken brooder. <laughs> forgot what it was called. All right, brooder project update. Got the base done. The boys are playing on it currently, building their own little handy projects. What are you building, Jackson? A chair. A chair, okay. Out of some scrap wood? Mm-hmm. Although apparently some of it's not quite scrap yet. <laughs> this is one of the end walls for the mini brooder. This is a little window for airflow and light. Nice. plywood on it. Guys, this thing is huge. I think it's supposed to hold like 250 chickens. Yeah. 250. We're getting 150. Um, but it's very big and very heavy. <laughs> Good morning. It is another cold day in Kentucky and we are working on the mini brooder again needs to get finished because we have chickens coming really soon are you cold <laughs> hey, Ma. about to put the doors on oh are they built? all right no we gotta put this bracing in first and then doors <laughs> Yeah, it's huge. Should we, <laughs> should we order another 100 birds to put in it? <laughs> no. Can you push it up just a little bit? Right there, stop, perfect. <laughs> oh, that was fun. Aw, I missed it. Aw, bummer. <laughs> And hey, it's, look, it's an entrance for gap, right? Yep, yep, that's to ventilation. So that's on purpose, yeah. Okay, so we're here. We're putting on the finishing touches to the brooder. We have handles that we want to install on the lids, help them open, and then we're just going to get it set up. Heat lamps, bedding, make sure the waters are good because we have chickens coming. awkward of an angle because you instantly go that way, mm -hmm. right? Like, 
but it is more helpful. <laughs> all right so we're all set we've got heat lamps feeders waterers bedding what do we just need, now? need chickens <laughs> That'll be the next video. That's it. All right. Next time.